Now, I like the way this matchup's starting. Yeah, some good sportsmanship, or <laughs> maybe not. Now's no time for sportsmanship. These two want to tear each other apart. It was just a handshake. That was pretty embarrassing, guys. You know, I just hate when two superstars can't be on the same page just to start between these competitors based on. The thing about this is these superstars don't just dislike each other. They don't respect each other. Now, in this business, you have to earn your respect. If a handshake doesn't work, maybe a little. Oh. Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Accurate. Shifts it back on to. Quick exchange of. These two having an answer offense here. Giovanni Vinci has a reputation for having a non-stop in-ring motor. Think that excellent conditioning could give him an advantage and keep his foot on the gas throughout the match. I think I hit. Boom! Head first. And he slides him back to the mat. to fight back and Vinci, and Vinci isn't looking helpless anymore Vinci was being tested and was finally able to get some offense of his own in right down on a no good landing to a break and they failed to hit the mark pop way up driven down back taking it starting to pile up there's a serious grudge that needs to be worked out. Place to do it. The time for talk is over. Now we'll see if actions can put an end to this round. Or. Just a barrage of strikes. This relentless. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is. Oh, uh, Corey, look at this. Pump handle locked in. Into the Death Valley driver. He's down, and he might be out. It is enough. Finally, it's over. Here is your winner, Buddy Matthews. A disheartening loss, to say the least. They really wanted to prove them wrong in this one. Adding injury to insult. First, you make clear you know you're better than the competition. Then you straight up prove it when the bell rings. I'm sure they feel mighty big right about now. As they should, they're getting their arm raised after all, Saxton.